Hi everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Pyramid and Tell. If anyone out there knows of a Pegasus level malware detector, please drop it in the comments. I've reached out about it for I've reached out about this before, but no one has responded to me. And I'm not joking. If anyone um, has a recommendation, I would be like to hear that. If you've been trying to reach me through the 785 business number that I have listed online, those messages have been diverted for a really long time and the messages cannot be located right now. No one seems to know where they're going. So uh, that's always fun. I will list my office address below. If anyone happens to come across this video and you've been trying to reach me, try snail mail. At this point, it seems a lot more reliable. So everyone, in my opinion, needs to really watch all their bank accounts, credit card accounts, everything like that. If a mistake is made in many banks and you do not detect it within 30 days, they will not reimburse you for that amount. What I am suggesting right now is that in this period of transition, the lights are on and nobody's home. They don't seem to be guarding things as closely as they could be. So you may want to make a daily, if not weekly, daily habit of checking your accounts and monitoring them very carefully. Some things they have normal deductions for will look as if they've been deducted by that company when it has a very, very small difference to it um, and it's not that account at all so just a heads up about that and when all else fails you can always wipe your computer but the way things are going if we don't figure this out soon we will be wiping our computer as much as we wipe our asses so we need to actually pay attention to this and come together and be aware, be awakened. So, is there anything else you have to say about that? <laughs> I had some, yes, oh yes, one other thing to say while we're on the topic of tech. There are many things that could cause the systems to go down uh, accidentally or intentionally, meaning uh, the systems that give the internet and um, empower all of your daily calendars and give you access to names, addresses, and phone numbers and everything. The world that we live in now, people do not know addresses and phone numbers and everything the way they used to. So if you were to suddenly poof, you know, and your electronics were gone, people have no idea what to do or where to go. They don't remember directions. You know, you're all very digitalized. So I'm suggesting that, again, like inventorying your home, what if uh, there were to be a little mishap and the electronics were to go down? Would you even have know your mother's new phone number or, you know, addresses and, and things of friends, things like that? I'm suggesting that perhaps you do a printout of your calendar just sort of as a backup so that you don't lose all of that information should something, you know, get a little tweaked moving forward. So just peace of mind, inventory your house, you know, make backups of everything uh, so that you have them in case of emergency, okay? Just to make things smoother. Okay, so I hope you're having a really great day. And remember, smile. It's totally awesome to be here on the planet. Life is beautiful, and I love you. Bye.